Hey y'all, welcome to my channel. My name is Alicia. If you're new here and I share reading and lifestyle videos, so I would love for you to subscribe to my channel. And if you're not new, then welcome back. For today's video, I'm going to be showing y'all how I got this really quick and easy Valentine's Day look with a couple different lip options. So if y'all want to see how I got it, then just keep watching. I knew that I wanted dewy, glowy skin for this look, so for foundation, I'm using the Charlotte Tilbury Beautiful Skin Foundation. It was a most used beauty product of 2022 and already a most used product of 2023 because it is just so good. It is very lightweight on the skin, which I love, and it is a sheer to light coverage. For my under eyes, I'm starting out with the Charlotte Tilbury Color Corrector, and then I'm going to go on top of it with Shape Tape Ultra Creamy, which is the more hydrating version of Shape Tape, and as of right now, it is on sale, so definitely go and check it out. There's a lot of other Tarte stuff on sale that I will link down below in the description box, along with everything else that I use in this video. I'm going to wait to set my face because I am going to be using some more liquid products on my cheeks, but I did want to go ahead and set my under eyes so my concealer don't get creasy. Another product that has been a favorite for years is the Shape Tape Glow Wand, which is a liquid highlighter. I have been using it again recently, and I love the glow that it gives you. And I do have a full video on all the different uses for this that I will link down below in the description box if y'all want to check that out next. So I actually bought this product last year, but only recently started using it and I fell in love and it is another Charlotte Tilbury product and it is the Glowgasm Beauty Light Wand and this is the shade Peachgasm, which is a really pretty coral color. It does come in other colors and she did just come out with some matte ones, but y'all know me, I love a good glow, but if glow is not your thing, definitely check out the matte ones. Now that I'm done with all my liquid products, I'm going to set everything with a translucent setting powder. That way it won't change the color of anything. And I'm just going to set my blush with this as well and just lightly go over it. That way it will still kind of be glowy, but it won't change the color. If you wanted to, you can set your blush with a similar color blush. For brows, I'm using the Maybelline Ultra Slim Pencil in the shade Deep Brown. This has been a favorite for a while now. I love the skinny pencil because it gives you the hair-like strokes, so makes your brows look really natural. And then it has a spoolie on the other side to blend everything out. I wanted to keep the eyeshadow very, very simple, so I'm starting out with just a nude color as my base. This is going to set where I put the concealer, and then it's also going to even out my eyelids. I felt like my cheekbones were still glowy from the glow wand, but I decided to add a powder highlight on top, and this one was the Jaclyn Cosmetics Loose Highlighter in the shade Balm, which is a really pretty gold. And now I'm just lining my lower waterline with a nude eye pencil. This one is from Tarte. It is my absolute favorite, and it is called Fake Awake, and it is also part of that sale. And now I'm lining my upper waterline with black. This is going to make your lashes look fuller and thicker. And I'm doing this since I'm not doing false lashes. I'm just wearing mascara. That way it will make it look a little bit more dramatic. And then I'm going to start on my eyeshadow, which is super simple. And I'm just using two colors. And I'm starting off just by using a bronzer. This is the same bronzer I'm going to use on my face. And I'm applying it to my crease and just a little bit above. And then I'm going to take a clean fluffy brush to blend out the edges. I am also using that same bronzer to buff it along my lower lash line. You don't have to use a color on the lid. Normally when I do this look, I don't, but I did want to add a little bit of something since it is a Valentine look, and I'm just using that same Jaclyn Cosmetics highlighter that I used on my cheekbones. Next, I'm adding my mascara, and I can't tell you the last time I have used a lash curler, but since I'm not wearing false lashes, I wanted my natural lashes to be as dramatic as they could be, so I'm actually using a lash curler today. But if you did want to kind of spice up this look, you can definitely throw on a pair of false lashes. And now for the fun part, the lipstick, which is the last step, and here is what pink would look like. If you've been wanting to try pink lipstick, I feel like Valentine's Day is the perfect occasion for it. And this is one of my favorite pinks, which is MAC Candy Yum Yum. So here is what the pink looks like. And keep watching for red. 
One of my favorite red lipsticks is MAC Ruby Woo, but I've really been loving this Maybelline Superstay Ink Crayon in the shade Own Your Empire. It has that blue tint that makes your teeth look white, which we all love. And whenever I do a red or dark lip, I like to do my lipstick first and then use a lip liner to go around the edges and sharpen them and clean them up. So here is the completed look. As you can see, super quick and easy. And when you add a bold lip, I feel like it makes it look like you took a lot of time on your makeup when it really didn't. So that is my little trick. And since the makeup is so neutral, you can do any color you want. So if you are not comfortable with this bold color or the pink, then you can do a nude or any color that you are comfortable with. Let me know down below in the comments if you like the pink lipstick or the red better. But I really hope that y'all enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I make new videos every week, but I don't have anything else to say except thank you for watching and I'll see you on my next video.